fasting, the, the Bible, the Word of God, and my favorite thing is the Holy of Holies. And uh, there is the Holy of Holies visit right now today, and we're going to talk about that. It's going to be an absolute blast. If I had the time Good morning. Good morning. Or just watching church. But so you're gonna put music over it. Uh, listen, time is our most mm -hmm. precious resource. How many would agree with that? Spouses look away from each other. <clears throat> Don't be elbowing anybody. Hello. Okay. I'm gonna try and do my own eyebrows. Which could go very wrong. So I've got a spoolie and then I've got like eyebrow cutting scissors because my eyebrow hairs are so long. So we're just gonna cut, I think. I think is how we're gonna do it. I'm gonna brush them up. Look how long. They're so long. Okay. Alright, I'm just gonna cut. I'm kind of short too. Okay. That doesn't look too bad. Here, I turn this light off. There we go. That looks better. It's kind of orange. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is so scary. My face is like breaking out so bad right now. I had an allergic reaction to rosehip oil. And now it's like red, pimply, itchy. It looks pretty bad. Okay. Right there. Oh, can you hear that? I can't get this one here. Okay. All right. I think we'll just leave that one at that, and we'll move on to that. Because my biggest thing is right here. It starts growing down, and I want them to be more lifted. Why is this the most painful thing? Right. 
I didn't even get a hair and that hurt. Okay. Y'all, am I just a sissy? Or is this like the most painful thing for anybody else? Am I just dramatic? All right, that's it. I'm done. I'm so done. All right, I'll show you the. <laughs> that's them. And that's all I'm doing because it hurts too bad. Okay. Peace and love. Drifting on the ocean, sometimes I pass by an island, but there's nothing there for me. I move on as the wind blows, hoping to wash up on that shore, and the sand will hold me. Blue, the water and sky, reflection in my eye, and it's true. So true that my life, that my life is a she shy. About your love every day and night I can't sleep when you're gone Ooh, The water and sky Reflection in my eye And it's true So true That my life That my life Is she shy doing the workout that you probably just saw a little sweaty um the room we're in is 80 degrees so literally it doesn't take much yeah. we were drenched if you guys could see the crotch sweat should i show them is that weird we also kind of <laughs> is that weird, weird if i show you my crotch sweat i don't even know <laughs> <laughs> you can't see it these leggings are from airy and they show sweat like the first exercise we did, you could see my crotch sweat. <laughs> and we ended up wearing like the same outfit. It was oh yeah, this not was unplanned. unplanned. I opened all. the door and I was like, stop it. And I almost wore a hat too. So it was almost head to toe. I'm wearing so, a hat because my hair is extremely greasy. <laughs> but I didn't want to take a shower because I knew we were going to work out. But um, we're just sitting down here because we're going to film. We're going to answer the questions that we asked on our um, Instagram. We did a like Q&A. A while Pole. ago, yeah, I it's been a while. Ago. So we figured we'd answer them now because better late than never. Better than never. <laughs> that's right. 
Okay, so our first question is our go-to Starbucks order. Ooh. I know you have a specific one, so. Well, I just, I just created one. But it's, it's really good. I don't know, it's kind of the holiday yeah. syrups. But get it while you can. Um, okay, so it's a grande cold brew with two pumps of the toasted white chocolate and then peppermint cold foam. Mm. It's delicious. Mm. And it's not too sweet. It's not overly yeah. sweet like most of their stuff. Um, but it tastes like uh, Christmas in Florida. It's the best way to describe it. And mine is, I just get an almond milk honey flat white because I love the blonde espresso that's in it. And I feel like mm -hmm. I drink coffee every day and that's like the drink that I can actually feel like the caffeine hitting me. I'm like, whoo, I feel like I'm. The honey flat whites are really good. Yeah, I love them. I think they're my favorite. Um, let's see. Next question is how we got our puppies. If you don't know, I have like a year and a half old German Shepherd. Can't believe she's, she's a big girl. And I got her from um, a girl that I'm friends with on Facebook. Her dogs had puppies and she posted about them. And I messaged her and was like, oh my gosh, I want one so bad. And she was like, we have one girl left. And I was like, I'll take her. And um, she's the love of my life. So <laughs> it was like a very fast like split decision because she was like the last one left and I was like I have to have her and the day I met her she like put her head on my shoulder and just rested and I was like she's the one and I was so happy <laughs> uh, both of our dogs are Craigslist puppies so we call them rescue dogs because yeah. the homes they came from were they're basically rough. rescue dogs yeah um, I have a seven month old golden retriever named Hank he is extremely mm. protective over me and he's, sweet is, as can he's be. my shadow. He follows me around the house all day long. Mm. Um, and then I have a nine month old uh, Beagle Dachshund mix, Daisy. And she's just she's sweet as pie. She's a sweetheart. She, she's she's so my sweet. snuggler. Hank gets too hot because he's so big. <laughs> so he likes to lay beside you, but he does not want to snuggle because it's too Aww. hot. But Daisy will lay right up on you, and it's the sweetest thing. Also, the love of my life. <laughs> Both <Okay>. my puppies. <laughs> the next question we got was how and when did y'all meet? And when people ask me this, I feel like this is hard mm -hmm. because I feel like we've known each other for a long time. We've known each other since. So we grew up in the same we were, church. Yeah. Since so we were, we were really in like little. the nursery together as kids. Yeah. But we like. I feel like we don't really know each other. Like we just. We got close in like high school. Yeah. I transferred we high same, schools. Yeah, we went in the same youth group and stuff, but mm -hmm. we, we kind of had separate friend groups. Mm -hmm. And then once we got to high school and we cheered together, that's when we really got close, yeah. I feel like. Yeah, I transferred high was, school like in the middle, like 11th grade I moved, and that was like 2016, 15, and 2015, 2016. Yeah. <laughs> and that's when we so almost, were close. Wow, so about six But we've known years. each other for our whole lives. That's crazy. But like I've known who she is for a long probably time. Probably like six years now. <laughs> yeah. Which is insane. Yeah. Okay. Next question is where do you live? Um, I'm not going to give you my address, <laughs> but we both live in Jacksonville, Florida. Yeah, um, like the south side of Jacksonville. Yeah. Closish yeah. to the town center. Yeah, like it's, it's like January like, yeah. 2nd right now and it's what, 80 degrees? It's so, so hot. <laughs> this is us in like winter weather <laughs> um next question are where are you guys from i'm from jacksonville well i consider myself from callahan because i feel like i grew up over mm -hmm. there but technically i'm from jacksonville so i've lived here my whole life i've wanted to move just to experience new things but my husband's a firefighter so i can't really do that <laughs> i'm kind of stuck here yeah i i was born in jacksonville lived here for the first couple years of my life but most of the time i was in callahan yeah callahan girls. and then came back to jacksonville callahan after um, we graduated <laughs> let's see are you guys sisters no no <laughs> no just good friends, good friends. I actually don't really look much like my sisters. I look more like my younger sister. Yeah, you look we just have different features. Like she has yeah. brown eyes and darker hair and I have blonde hair and blue eyes. 
Um, let's see. How long have you guys been friends? We'd say close friends for like six years. We're gonna go with six years. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Final answer. Um, let's see. How did you guys meet? Basically cheerleading, I think. Yeah. West Nassau cheer. Yeah, we struggled together through practice and that's how we bonded from the torture. But we were good. I know. <laughs> we were really good. <laughs> we used to be in excellent shape too. Yeah. We're in, we're in pretty good shape We're in now. good shape, but... But some of the stuff we used to do... I know. We talk about it all the time. We're like, how did we do that? We used to do the weightlifting team in the morning. At like 7 in the morning. Which was early for us. Yeah. Because school started at 9, so I'd usually wake up at 8. Yeah, we'd go and lift weights, and then we would go to practice after school for like, what, two hours? Two, two and, and a half, some yeah. night, some days, that was an accent, some days I would go to the gym afterwards to, um, I was pretty much on crack. I didn't take Adderall, <laughs> but it probably looked like I did because of how much <laughs> we would go and, but even like after practice we would still hang out and stuff. And you would think I don't being know how I did dead tired. I don't either. And we made good grades. I did cheat one time though, and I got in trouble for it <laughs> on a poem. Shout oh, out poem. to Alex if you remember that. Oh, oh yeah, gosh. oh yeah, we got written up for it because I copied. She wanted us to write a poem, and like I didn't want to do that, so I copied off of my friend Alex before school, not knowing that Alex copied off of five other people before class. Oh no! So then, like seven of us had the same poem, and she was like, "What a mess!" And I had no idea, and I got in so much trouble. <laughs> Um, okay, next question is favorite park you've been to? I feel like I like could- Like a national park or just a we could, park We could do like amusement park and like park park. Oh, amusement park. Oh, I was okay. thinking amusement park, but we could answer that I was thinking like and a national park. like national park. Okay. I really don't know. Mine is probably Universal Islands of Adventure. Mm -hmm. Both, both of those. Mm -hmm. I consider those too. Harry Potter World is like my yes. favorite. Frozen Butterbeer. I love Delicious. Harry Potter. Fun fact, I love Harry Potter. Yes. I love all the Harry Potter movies. I don't have my keys in here. I don't think. Oh, maybe I do. I have, a, I have the Deathly Hollow symbol on my keys. Um, national Park? It's a smoky mountain. Mine's <laughs> National Park. They have a National Park. <laughs> I feel like I've been to one up there. They have a national park. It's been a um, Mine is Yellowstone. I've never been there. And I really want to go to Yosemite in California. Mm -hmm. That's on my on my list for national parks is Yosemite. That sounds fun. I'll get there eventually. I don't think I think I'm really boring and I just haven't been to a lot of national parks. What about parks. Amusement Park? Was well, Universal? I went to one in Georgia. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But I went to a national park in Georgia. And I can't remember the name of it. I'm really sorry. I fidget it so was a much. Lot of fun. I think I've switched fun. positions maybe six times. I just can't sit still. <laughs> what else? We need to go to an amusement park. Yeah. I know. I've I been to like one that. since. I told him I want to go to the Harry Potter last world. time. So I yeah, made my husband you. watch all of the Harry Potter movies before we got married because I was like. I can't marry you if you've never if seen you've Harry never Potter. Seen like, this is a big deal to me. And so he watched all of them before we got married. Um, my favorite park in Jacksonville, if you live close to Jacksonville, is at Austin Park. Because that's <laughs> where <laughs> the first thing that came to mind. <laughs> that's where my dog, they have a dog park there. And that's her favorite park. She loves to go and play there. And then they have like a trail that you can walk or run, and we go there and run sometimes. We'll be running it soon. Yeah, we gotta last, get started. It wasn't last year, the year before. We did the Gate River Run here, and we would go there and we'd run and train. And it's yeah. a pretty run, it's not like you're running in a straight line at like yeah, the sidewalk or something. There's different it's fun. If, yeah, if we don't do that, then we'll run like along mm -hmm. the river, just to get the, the elevation oh, yeah, with the, the bridges, river. to get ready for the gate. that's a whole but, different. Running yeah, those maybe, bridges, you're like, Maybe we'll film our training yeah. process. Yeah. Because we got to start soon. It's in about two months. Yeah. We have two months to train. I downloaded their training schedule, though. Who? Mm -hmm. Their training it's schedule. Fine. No, it's in March. It's the first weekend in March. They, they put up a training schedule, though, and it starts on the 16th of January. Okay. And it has it laid out like how many miles you should do on what days. We can do this. 
We can do this. This is like a live reaction because I really thought I had. <laughs> we could do it. We could do it. I I'm nervous. Sign up for it. Last time I started training in November, and now I'm starting in January, so I'm a little worried. I started in like October but last year, I think. No, you know, you started in January. I did. Yeah. You'll be fine. Okay. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. We're gonna keep telling ourselves that we'll be fine. If not, wish us luck. They have food and stuff along the way that you can do. It is really It's a good fun. time. It's just fun. And at the end of it, I, everybody, like, there's food trucks and, like, a concert. And yeah. it's fun at the end, so. I remember smiling the whole race because it was just so enjoyable. Yeah. Like, there's so many people cheering. A few times I was like, don't cry. <laughs> don't cry. Like, All right, guys, we're going to go get Alrighty. some food. You can see the, the lighting And then change. we might go get ice cream to reward ourselves for working will. out. <laughs> see you next time. <laughs> We're going to get wits. Frozen custard. <laughs> Look at the sunset. I don't know if you guys can see. I'm gonna introduce Kaylee to her first witty. your love every day and night I can't sleep when you're gone ooh, 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 ooh. the water and sky reflection in my eye and it's true so true that my life that my life is a shade shine 